right, today we're going to talk about algorithms. So what is an algorithm? A sequence of instructions where the main goal is to solve a specific problem, perform a certain actions, or computation. It's a very clear specification or instructions of what to do. So first algorithm I want to go to is brushing your teeth. First, get your toothbrush and toothpaste. Open the cap on the top of the toothpaste. Cover the top of the toothbrush with toothpaste. Open your mouth. Bring the toothbrush to your mouth. And in a circular motion, brush every single individual tooth for a total of three minutes. Rinse your mouth with and toothbrush with water. Put cap on toothbrush and clean up any mess. So everyone knows how to brush their teeth, but each individual instructions has to be detailed enough so that people know what step to do it in and when to do it. So even though brushing your teeth might be a simple task, I need at least, in my example, seven, but you can go into much more detail on how to brush your teeth. So algorithms are just detailed instructions of what to do. So the next example, math. So how to divide 68 by 3. So how many times does 3 go into 6? So 2. How many is left? 8. So you put the 2 in the tens place. How many times does 3 go into 8? Again, 2. How much is left? A remainder of 2. So the answer of how to divide third, or 68 by 3. 68 divided by 3 is 22 with a remainder of 2. So computers, computer scientists use algorithms to tell a computer what to do and how to do it. When you search anything on Google, a computer algorithm created by an employee at Google is finding the best results for what you have searched. YouTube is also running an algorithm to predict what you want to watch next and what the recommended videos are going to push to you. Ads collect data with what you search and buy off the internet to give you personalized ads on what you might buy next. Algorithms are used everywhere and are being used for almost everything.